Alright, hello everybody and welcome back to the channel and um, today I'm here with another look into the upcoming update for The Sims Freeplay. I just want to say early access to the beta is provided by EA Fire Monkeys. So thank you to them for sending me this. Um, I also want to apologize for my voice. I have a really bad cough right now, so if I cough, I'm going to do my best to try and edit them out, but I can't really guarantee it because, you know, when you go to edit, you tend to forget some things. So, yeah, we are here with the French romance update, um, and yeah, um, I'm pretty sure this is kind of similar to kind of what they've had before for, like, um, Valentine's Day, and this, I think this is basically what the Valentine's Day update is going to be, if I'm not 100% sure. So, whew, I'm already going to be coughing here in a minute. So, we have the French Romance new live event. Everything you need to know, um, or <laughs> everything you need to design a romantic French getaway for your Sims. Collect, collect craft items to unlock new prizes and choose the ones you want. So, we're going to go ahead and hit start collecting. Um, and it says, um, a fro, 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 okay. French romance live event. Place a crafting station. You progress the French romance, wow, live event by collecting arts and craft items. You'll need a crafting station for that. Go to the event items tab of the home store and place the candle station in the home lot. Alrighty, so we're going to go ahead and head over here. Okay, so event items. And it says the candle station. So we have the candle station, pottery station, jewelry station, and glassware station. Ooh, fancy. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and grab this. I don't know exactly where I'm going to put this. Um, okay, so how big does it need to be space-wise? Um, okay, so what I'm going to do is actually... I'm going to go ahead and put these in the inventory. Yes, it's going to be right here. Um, just like, right, like, like, let's do, let's do that right there. Okay. Task complete. All right. So make some arts and craft items. Now that you have crafting, a crafting station, your sim can make arts and crafts items to unlock prizes in the French romance live event. Have a sim make some candles from a candle station. All righty. So let's go ahead and make 50 candles. It only takes 23 seconds. That's that's really nice. It's not going to take too long. So I'm going to go ahead and go over here and show you guys what it's going to look like. Interesting. I've never seen this object, so I don't know if it's like new. Maybe it is. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, she failed. That sucks. Start all over again. All right. Oh, okay. So we have the first part of it done. So that's exciting. So it looks like we have unlocked mood lighting. Set the mood of any room with a soft glow of French lighting. Ooh, awesome. So this is what we need. Um, so it unlocks each. So it's kind of like like previous live events like this. So that's that's nice. Um, and then we actually have some daily goals, so I'm going to go ahead and claim those that we can anyways. Alright. Restra- Re- I cannot talk today. This is a totally bad day for me to freaking record. Oh, I'm just all over the place. Restock a crafting station. Occasionally you may need to restock arts and craft stations with supplies. The candle station just ran out of- out and needs to be restocked. Have a scene perform a restock action on a candle station. Alrighty. So we're going to go ahead and restock two uses. Okay. So it only takes 10 seconds. So that's not bad. Okay. I like that. Simple. Okay. Buy the mood lighting pack. You've collected enough arts and craft items to unlock the mood lighting pack. Go to the French Romance event screen and buy the mood lighting pack with arts and craft items you just collected. Alrighty, so we're going to go ahead and purchase. <clears throat> yes, congratulations. 
You have unlocked the mood lighting pack. Find it in the lighting section of the home store and start setting the mood of any room with the soft glow of French lighting. Ooh, yay. Okay. All right, use a coin flower patch. Okay. Um, let's go here. Oh, wait, no. I think we have to do it differently. Let me, let me look again. Um, find one. Oh, okay. It's in the event. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. Coin flower patch. <laughs> Alrighty. So we're going to go ahead and have you come over here and go ahead and, and win event resources. Alrighty. So we're going to go ahead and hit play. <laughs> oh, I love this song. Ooh, oh, we almost got three butterflies. So we have one, two. <coughs> I'm so sorry. We have one, two construction coins. Yay! Check the daily rewards. Okay. Alrighty. Um, collect bonuses. To collect arts and crafts items faster, check in regularly and tap an icons floating above your sim's head for the bonus. Have a sim collect arts and craft items when you're from any crafting section or station. Okay. So we are going to go ahead and do make 345 candles. Um, and I'm going to wait, obviously, to use any of my um, sim points or not sim points, LPs, life points. Until we get that option to collect bonuses. <laughs> you know, I really need to get back into The Sims Free Play. Um, I was playing it on my iPad, but um, for some reason I just kind of stopped playing it, which I don't understand, honestly. It doesn't make any sense why I stopped. Um, but I think a lot of it was because I just kind of left my iPad in my room. So I've never actually been able to like check up on it. But, um, I used to play it, like, literally, religiously on my phone. Which, like I said, I don't understand why I don't anymore. But, whatever. Alright, so I'll be back once we are able to collect the bonuses. Alrighty, so we have a little candle floating above our sim's head, which means we can collect some bonuses. Awesome. Alright, can you continue collecting arts and craft items. Well done. Collect arts and craft items to unlock and buy more prizes. Have some craft items on the crafting station to get all the prizes. This event ends in eight days and eight hours. Alrighty, so that is basically what you guys are supposed to do. Um, and eventually, like I said, or like it said, it will unlock new items the more things that you um, are able to unlock. So um, the next thing to unlock is actually the French. French ambience start setting the scene of your romantic of your romantic whatever with the walls and floors of southern fence and then we have the decorative openings decorative windows and doors will welcome your sense to the ta tasteful and classic styles of French homes um bedroom suite Ooh, I love that bed this bedroom pack will allow you to customize an end suit an end suite of any romantic French I can't, I can't pronounce that word. Ch chatty it? I don't know. Bathroom suite. A large pack of tasteful French bathroom ornaments. Layered in copper and gold. Fancy. Um, fine dining. A dining room pack to prepare your sims for a very best French cuisine. Um, chef's cuisine. Oh my god. Those are nice. Every aspiring ch chef will love this kitchen pack to practice the masters of arts fr of French cuisine. Ooh la living room. Ooh, I love that bookshelf. Shoot. Your sims can relax in style with a clean and comfortable pack of French living room furniture. French tapestry. Tapestry. Decorate your whatever with a large pack of the highest quality French tapestry. Tapestry. Um, crepe cart. The French crepe cart will keep your sims satisfied with some of the very best traditional French desserts. Yummy. Gourmet tasting. Sims can enjoy tasting a variety of hard and soft cheeses together atop an oak barrel. Oh, 
Oh my god, this is amazing. Lover's portrait painting. Master the art of French portrait painting. Ooh la la. I can tell I can tell I would totally get my sense to totally freaking do some French portrait paintings. Like, come on. Love Lock Fountain. Your Sims can demonstrate your their love forever with the Love Lock Fountain. Aww. And then the French whatever. The French Cadillac whatever temple features a unique home lot in a can't pronounce it by the sims free play team Ooh, and then of course the moonlighting that we've already gotten so that is basically what you will get if you let your sims go ahead and discover all of these the nice thing about this is some of these events are actually like community events and you need your community to help you get it which is good because the community around the sims free play and the sims in general is just so big that it would work but i do like that they kind of let you do it at your own pace because some people like to finish it obviously early and stuff like that so anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this video and um this is kind of just an idea of what to look forward to for this update i really hope you guys enjoyed this video and um this update should be up you know eventually i don't know the live date and so yeah but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope you guys have an awesome awesome day i'll talk to you guys on my next one bye everyone